Hello and welcome to this uh, quick introductory guide to the, this is the ZD10 LCD. Uh, we've got a few videos on this which you've probably seen or you probably have if you've uh, got an interest in it. Uh, basically, quick summary of it, this is a, a step and up controller which is intended for primarily for NEMA 23, although it will work with um, anything smaller than that and it will also go up to small NEMA 34s, but we we tend to focus much more on NEMA 23s with it, uh, basic things like the, the sort of mounting holes, um, you've got an 8x2 LCD screen here, four buttons along the bottom that you can see. Um, if you have a quick look at the back, you can see you've got your power in here, motor phases here, and then a bit of a box header there. We do sometimes, we offer a version of this where we have the, the screen as a, as a separate mounted on a separate board, depending on um, what, you, what you're building. Um, it, can make, it can make things a bit easier for you. Um, it's very, very easy with this one to custom program it. So for example, a very common thing that we do, I'll, I'll show you the basic program in a second, but. A common thing that we do with this one would be to just tailor it to we can use the standard sort of program but we can tailor it so if you want um, you know, if you've got a product name or you want your company name to come up as it starts if you want to change the bits of the program perhaps there's bits of it that you the standard sort of program that we put on here that you don't need or there might be bits that you want to change the resolution on or whatever it is we can we can do that fairly quickly um, so it's it's one that's it's fairly easy, it's straightforward and not too expensive to get it customised. So I'll just quickly wire it up and then we can have a quick look at it. Just some of the key features we're talking about. Um, there is, with this one, we do sort of have, I think if you, if you are looking on the website, there is, there is a standard page there where if you wanted to request any sort of customization, anything like that, there's a form there that we've set up to try and just help. Um, just capture all of the different things really, because it's, it's, it's difficult with this one when you're customizing it. It's sometimes you might think you've got an idea um, in, your, in, your, in your mind, which, which is very, sort of makes sense to you. Um, however, in reality, sometimes just, just how you structure the program can be a key part of it. We often try and do things with flow charts, um, just just to give us a really, you know, solid, straightforward understanding of, of what's required. Once we've got that, we can then get you a quote across. It usually, only takes a couple of hours um, just to work that out. Depends, you know, if if you if you're looking to just sort of build on what we've already got on here, that's usually very simple. Um, sometimes it can be. A little bit more complicated but we'll try and let you know as soon as we can so you can see there now right in so we'll just power on and you can see that we've got the basic thing there the general setup here um, it's all on the manuals and everything like that but you've got up down buttons in the middle the sort of enter button on the right hand side and then your options on the left so because it's just slightly out of shape, just move this I've got a small fairly small NEMA 23 on this one so normally, I think the default setting goes to with the current. If I just go, yeah, 4.16. So that's that's a little bit strong for this. So I will drop that down. I'm using this button here. Let's drop it down to 1.3. See what we've got. So I need to exit again and then press the left one. We're up and running there. You can see that. So at the moment, because it's designed for pumps, you can see that it's got it's designed. Um, to, to tell you how many mil um, has gone. It's very much, um, I'm just thinking if you if you want in if you want in more, I don't want to sort of go through all of the all of the um, detail on the pump program here because I know we do have other videos on this. But um, you can see with this one it's 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 just designed for, for pumps but we can change the application. So hopefully that's given you a quick basic introduction into this. If you do have any questions, you do have anything uh, that you want to customise with it or you want to discuss with us, just get in touch. We're more than happy to uh, have a chat about that. Thank you very much.